Hey guys, it's Nerp here, and today we are going to be doing a bit of judgment. First off, I'll explain to you a bunch of stuff that happened today, real life today. This is Sunday. I don't know the date, <laughs> but um, so last Sunday in November. Think of it that way. Uh, number one, it's awesome. So this morning I played a couple rank matches. I was second behind PUQ, and I uh, leapfrogged him. Which is funny because later in the day, the 6th uh, Scrolls Autumn Cup Series ESL Tournament happened. If you don't know what that is, link in the description. The ESL Cups are like tournaments for scrolls that happen every so often. So that happened um, later in the day after I took over the one spot. And I placed second to that, second in that tournament. And the person who beat me in the finals was none other than QQ. Pretty cool to see the number 1 and 2 current ladder players battle it out in the uh, final of the ESL tournament but um yeah I actually recorded the entire tournament but um I just it my computer was gonna burst in flames if I didn't delete all the footage it was like four hours of footage and my computer could not handle it so if you really want to see some of that um some of me destroying some opponents early on but then getting destroyed by PQ in the finals um and I'm sure you can find it on like Twitch somewhere or like people who like streamed it. But yeah, so Team Badger, the Badger Guild is doing well in high ranks. Me, Slin, Color Plant, Blinky, Magpie Man, uh, Smogan. Yeah. So let's go for some judgment. Because I'm only in first by like seven rating points, but that's cool. Use gold. Yeah, we don't have much gold now, because I bought a ton of stuff. A ton. Um, oh, before I um, draft this deck, I just want to show you my experience of Judgment and what cards I've gotten from Judgment, so you can see a little quick montage of pictures of... I always take a picture at the end of my Judgment like run of the cards I took and the amount of gold to see how many kinds I want. So, here I go. Here's all my Judgments. Alright, so now let's pick. Um, let's see. So, first three picks, very crucial. I see a charge coil here. Wait, by the way, burn was made un uh, was made uncommon. It was common, so now you won't see as much as that, which is good. Um, wing soldier, I see a wing soldier. I don't think I'll be using restless bones. I'm gonna take a wing soldier just because it's the best thing here. Um, I see two animivores. I can get like a scavenger kind check. That'd be awesome. Um, I kinda want to take the charge coil. So far, I'm not really seeing a theme here. Charge coil is just a beast, so I'm going to. What is this? I can't. On the charge coil, see the, the picture on the right? Minus one attack? Is that some glitch or something? Is minus one attack? What? Whatever. Um, yeah, let's take the charge coil. It's good. Okay, see, now we get a spark and a ducal skirmisher. We do have that wing soldier, so we don't know. I'm gonna take languid or animivore. It's like a languid, it's just good. Another animivore, wow. I'm not playing ranked. Um, Eager Scar is cool, not great. I see a focus down here. I think I'm going to take a. an Eager Scryer. And I see another Eager Scryer, Metal Heart, great. Alright, this is not a great draft so far. I'm gonna take the Skirmisher just because it's greatest thing there huh this mystic altar could be used cool um in a cool way with the eager scryer thick focus hmm maybe we should go for energy i have no idea i guess i'll just take the raider and the outcast or raider and altar yeah I, there's an elder there that's good let's take the raider and then the elder 
and then the charge coil. So that was awesome. <laughs> Look at those picks. Raider, Outcast, Raider, Elder. And I have two charge coils. Okay, so I think we're in energy. Um, proximity charge. Yeah. So many structures. I'm going to go for incendiaries. Sister the Fox. Hmm. What, what do I have in Decay? I have a Languid and an Eager Scry, right? Yeah, that's it. Hmm. I think like any of these lines would be so good in an easy Eager Scry, so it attacks every turn. Um, I think I'm just going to take the Proximity Charge. And now plating or spark or trisman. I'm gonna go for a spark. Spark is too good. Um, clock library. We got a nice choice here. Supercharge, law memorial, dust runner, or plating. I think I'm gonna take the dust runner. We got another uneasy alliance, but we didn't choose it. Hmm, it's a tough choice. Scatter Gunner or Outcast? Outcast is going to be buffed by our Elder, but we only have one Elder in the deck, so... Mm, I think we might be in a little bit of growth. Not really, we only have a Sister of the Fox. I don't know, I'm going to take the Scatter Gunner, it's just a better creature. Raider. If we can get another uh, Elder, that'd be awesome. Um, I'll take the Tribesman. Or are we in order? We have, yeah, we have a couple of low order drafts. So yeah, I'm gonna take the order. So I'll take the transposition. Flip or plating? I think flip is better. The raider. Oh, gravehawk. Oh man, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna actually take a gravehawk. A siege cracker. I only have. I'll take an iron whip. Um, ooh, another charge coil. Um, hmm. Horn of Ages or Eye of Eagle? Where are we more in? Order or growth? We're much more in order. I'm gonna take the. Then the Gravehawk is so good, I wanna be in growth. And this. Now we're gonna take the charge coil here. You know what? Let's go ahead and take the. How much energy do I have? Is it possible to make a mono deck? 16. No, probably not gonna make it. Let's go for the. Horn of Ages. Um, I guess State Machine by default. Charge Coil. This gives order, which can be good. But I feel like Machination Mindset would be better. Um, are we really in order? A focus, a wing soldier, a flip, a transition. Yeah, we're definitely more in order than growth. I think we're just going to have to accept that. So I'm going to take the long memorial. Um, another focus down, that's nice. I guess a wing soldier. Um, increases growth. No, we don't want that. I guess just Ivy Eagle, just in case we do go in growth. Focus, plating, dark strike. No, uh, do we take the long or the ether pump? I'm gonna take the ether pump. I don't think we need, we're not gonna need too much growth. I mean, order. Um,. Purification. Two glimpage room. We have a lot of two drops to order. We're definitely gonna want to get to two order. Um, your porn of ages. We're doing sandpack one. We're make ones of growth. Nah. Porn of ages. Frost. Ooh, we got a forge. Um, many misses. Cool. No, these are all not good enough to be in a deck. Um. Forge. I see a spark. A raider. If our elder dies, then we're screwed. 
Oh, that's it. Um, <laughs> copper, maybe? And desperation over aging night. I think we have a lot of creatures, we don't need it. Okay. So let's see. Oh, we have 27 energy. Almost a mono deck. We want that. We want those three. Man, if we had a divinator, that'd be cool. Um, I'm currently playing without a mouse, so if you hear like large, hard hitting on a trackpad, then I'm sorry. So wow, we have four raiders, incendiaries we want, whip we want, long rail, plating. I don't know if we want same machine. Same machines are good together. Not one, I don't know if it's good enough. I'll put it in for now. I don't know if we want a lot of those scrolls, but right now we have a lot of good. We have 11 creatures, that's fine. But I really want to get all these two drops for Mortar in. And these little ones. Frostwind, eh. I don't think we're going to need purification. Let's see what we don't want. What do we not want? We don't want... State machine. You can go to the state machine, the proximity charges. Um, I don't think we're gonna let Frostwind or Horn of Ages get get in. Ah, but Horn of Ages is so cool. I think Flip is just better though. Um, hmm. Hmm. It's a tough choice here. I think I'm going to take out the Copper Auto. I think that's our deck. Uh, I don't know about this deck. It's it seems it's too. I think it's way too reliant on this Elder. Like I don't want any big creatures to just smash those idols. Besides, I guess these two Siege Crackers will be the idol smashers. I don't have any like big attacks besides this like Scatter Gunner and the Elder. I wish I had another Elder. That'd be awesome. I guess we'll get a lot of like creatures from the forge and stuff. Okay, uh Nerp is great. Okay. Alright. Um So let's go. We're ten minutes into the video. Let's try to play a match first time. We found a match. Alright, here we go. Good luck. Lieutenant Gottlieb. Gottlieb. Um, good, we got our, our elder early on. I think we're going to sack the plating. Okay. I think we'll be fine as long as we don't come across decks with like damning curses and bound dispersals on our elders. Um, desperation spark. I think we're gonna get rid of the. We have machin we have machination mindset in this, right? Yeah, we do. Oh, these guys are relentless too. I forgot about that. Spark. Scatter Gunner, how perfect. Um, I'll just put him right in the middle. All these grave locks. Lieutenant Gottlieb should be scared. Kinfolk Ranger. I'm just gonna sack for energy. I was gonna sack for cards so I could play the elder next turn. I just really want to get that elder out. So I can kill that next turn if he doesn't have anything to protect it with. Hopefully he protects it with someone with two health. 
So then I'll plop down my altar, and then that guy will just plow right through it. Plop. Put like a kinfold brave down in front of it. Oh. What do you have, dude? What do you have? Wildling. And he protects the wildling. Man, I haven't seen wildlings, like, I haven't used wildling myself since, um... Since, like, my old, like, growth precon days. Oh, that was cool lag. It, like, froze when, like, when the, um... When his guy was getting like impacted by the cannon by my scatter gunner. This guy's a beast. Oh, there's a wolf. No. Okay. Um, Dust Runner, we're gonna have to sacrifice and a siege cracker. Focus is good. Um, we're just gonna go all in right here. Moving in. No way anything here survives with all these guys attacking. And I have a pocket focus. Alright. I see. He's rocking the uh, Decay Bogleg Wanderer head. I have that head. From like buying like the Decay Precon when Decay was released. Came with it for free if you didn't know. When you bought the uh, Decay pre-constructed deck during the week of Decay, the week Decay was released, um, they gave you stuff. Oh no, he's going to um, put two units next to it, isn't he? No. Well, can't put it anymore. Or else I'll die. Oh well. And okay, um... His guys are attacking. I'm gonna sack the focus. Get a forge! That's awesome. Um... I think I'm gonna go with... Three there. This wildling I have to deal with soon. So I'm gonna. There's gonna be an attack of three by this guy. This guy could very well be dead. It's also gonna be an attack of three by that guy. I'm gonna put a forge right there. And a raider right there. Boom. So now he must choose what he's going to do. Come on, we play something next to the wild link. Make him die. Vitality well. So that's how he's gonna play another unit next to it. Oh. Let's see. So we start going into growth. Nah. Not growth, I meant to say order. Let's. We should probably start going into order, shouldn't we? Um. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we'll go pay three energy. Move you over. You down. Put you there. Put you there. Boom! Idle snipe. He sacks for scrolls. By the way, I'm not sure. Like when I play Judgment, like and I record it, I'm not sure if I'm gonna show all five match. Oh my god, that wild link! Five attack every turn. Do I have a violent dispersal in this deck? 
Wow, that thing's scary. Um, dun, dun, dun. Let's see, I'm gonna go 3-4. I, I think I'm gonna kill these two guys. I don't want that elder to die, considering all like all of my creatures are are elders. <laughs> I are uh, Gravelocks, so... Okay. So he has 5 attack. It's gonna hit something. And it would be awesome if he hit a be awesome if he hit a gun on him, son. So yeah. Don't hit the forge, please. Oh man, if he quakes here, I might cry. Yes, I don't know about judgment if I'm gonna like upload all the matches in each run, because that's just a lot of footage that my computer can't hold on to. Um, hmm. I have an iron whip. I could do something about that. Wait, can I kill that wildling this turn? If I iron whip the elder, I kill the brother in front, and I put three damage on that thing. No, I can't. Oh, he could still put things down next to the thing. Um, yeah, why did I put this clock library in front? I don't want it in front. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to... I wish this charge girl had haste. Then I'd be able to destroy it this turn. Because then I, I could put almost all the damage on that. Ugh, erg. I think I'm just going to let this guy do his thing. Um, I'm just going to sack for energy. I'm going to play a charge coil and a siege cracker. I'm going to put two damage on you move you guys down and hit that idol okay so now he's gonna kill my clock library Lieutenant Gottlieb. I think maybe for my judgment videos, I think I might only upload the draft and the first match. I would want to do the last match also so you can see my winnings and stuff. but And like how I'm choosing the stuff. Choosing what cards to keep. But, I don't know. That might make for like a 40 minute video which will cause my computer to stop working <laughs> all right wildling what are you gonna do what are you gonna attack attacks the gun auto interesting and puts a wildling down there all right this time we're not gonna let that wildling get as big as that wildling just that one has 5 plus attack. Not really sure how that happened though. Um. So. I think, we're, I think we can kill the wildling now. With iron whip. So we're going to sack. We're going to iron whip you. So now. We killed the wildling. Wait. Oh we could have won. Yeah we could have put. All that damage on that idol is dead. Then we could have iron whipped one of the siege crackers. Whoops. Oh well. Um, put you guys there. And I'll play a cast. Oh, that guy has Relentless. I forgot. Well, that was lucky. <laughs> the, um, 
charge coil hit the guy that had one else, so this would be four damage on the idol. Doesn't really matter though. And judgment just counts how many wins you got. Doesn't matter length of matches, length of the match, how many idols you destroyed. That's it. Did he just like quit on me? Come on, Lieutenant, you're better than that. Just take the surrender. Don't go for the old Alt F4. Then I have to wait a while to get my win. I don't even think surrenders are shown on your profile anymore. Check that after the match, but I'm pretty sure they aren't. Come on, you're putting on a bad example for the spectators too. Nah, he could just be like, his his, his computer could have just died, ran out of battery. That happened to me when I was playing Scrolls once. <laughs> In the middle of a match, all of a sudden the screen goes blank. Laptop wasn't plugged in for like an hour. Yep, things happen. Okay. My turn. Um. Gee. He doesn't even deserve a GG. He's not even there. Just stop accusing him of this. He he could just be having some technical difficulties. So hopefully I get five wins and get two thousand gold. That'd be good. Um, yeah, it's double gold weekend still for when I'm recording this video on Sunday, but I don't think it affects judgment. I think I heard that from like Reddit or something. It doesn't affect judgment. Well, that'll be it then. I think I'm gonna play some ranked right now before I uh, go to bed. So, um, thanks for watching and subscribe for more scrolls.